Good morning. Welcome back. The time right now is 924 and your consumer news getting back into the workforce after raising children. It can be hard for many women and men. So what can mom and dad do to use their experience to really benefit a company? Here with some great tips to really help us out here is our money and business expert, Derek Kinney. Good morning to you. Thank you, Cleo. Great to see you. Glad to have you in studio finally. My pleasure. Right? Although I love your jazzy background <laughs> when you do Thank Zoom you. with us, right? <laughs> All right. You said first, define your purpose and, and how do you do that? Well, like you said, this is for moms and dads who've mm -hmm. been at home for so long and now they're back in the workforce wondering, why am I doing this? So right. you want to have a compelling reason. It might be, I want to pay off debt. I want to send my kid to college. I want to catch back up on retirement. Or they may want to prove something. They want to say, I want my son or daughter to know that mom or dad could go back and do it mm. again. Or get this, tie a cause to it. Maybe you want to uh, ease homelessness or help people feel better about whatever the ails are in the world and you want to put a portion of your money toward a cause, but you want to have a compelling reason to get up every morning to go to that job. That makes sense. Now, I guess the first step is to get prepared. Where do we start? Yeah, so this is really cool. So there's a new term that I came across this week and it's called mom turn ships. Mom turn ships. So take ships. mom, combine okay. internships, mom turn ships, Dot com. It's this eight to 10 week training class. You can go online, you apply for it, mm -hmm. and it teaches you the skills to pay the bills, to get back into the workforce. Now, besides that, also what you wanna do is go back and quantify the skills you've got. For example, you probably weren't in your house for 20 years and never left. Right. You probably volunteered, managed, strategized, organized. Think about all the things you did that you could apply in a company because those skills as a manager, mm -hmm. as a leader, as a budgeter can do really well in a company. Derek, you are a finance expert. I mean, are you seeing a lot of stay-at-home moms or dads trying to get back into the workforce and then you say you got to think like an entrepreneur as well. Exactly. Well, they are because the economy's tight, inflation's high, pennies are being pinched. What you want to then do is think like an entrepreneur. So most people mm. expect to pay somebody is I like to say the salary gets you in the door, the bonus gets you wanting more. And business owners want people that don't just think like employees. So do three things. First of all, how can you increase sales in your current position? How can you reduce costs? And how can you help grow the business? If you can do those three things and talk to your boss about, hey, here's ways I'm helping you grow this business, you're gonna make more money be more valued and be more satisfied in your right. role. Be a necessity. Derek, yeah. how can people reach out to you? And if we have time really, really quick, the biggest mistake some of us make. Well, the biggest mistake is underestimating your skills. So many people think, oh, I've been at home for 20 years. Who would hire me? Think about this. Right now, there's so many young people in the market right now mm -hmm. and they need leadership. They want managers out there. You could be the shining star. You can reach me at Derek T. Kinney on Instagram and also on our new YouTube channel, The Derek Kinney Show. Which is really exploding, Derek. I'm, so, I'm so proud of you. Thank you so much for coming in studio My and pleasure. joining us this morning. Great tips. Thank you, Cleo. Appreciate All it. Right.